welcome guys um this is another tutorial to show you how you can be able to update your decoder and have interrupted view uh, in case you're having too many scrambled uh, channels that are not viewable on your end um, we are using the media star 4030 pro it's a 4k decoder just when you look at some of the key features of this decoder uh, it has uh, forever live tv then forever movies forever series kid series uh, kid movies music quran and a lot of uh, the other streaming um, channels you can also look at the iranian iranian channels here uh, there's youtube here there's a, a video over the demand service then you can go to the settings look at other applications that you can go through like apollo 5 um, there's even the ftp uh, download option you can use the qr code then the update is also here so um, this is one of the best decoders you can be able to use uh, now let's just dive deep into uh, the reason why uh, this video is going ahead so when you go to the networks here you need to first check your server remember this is the first server that you have to come to but uh, the most important server that you want to look at um, you can either scroll to your left or to your right then you look at um, server 15 i think you can look uh, extremely where there is ip stroke url whereby it changes to 34 i like to take it a little bit behind so that it can take me to the server that i want i think you can be able to see here the server type uh, is forever share pro uh, that is im 146 but we want it to get to the 147 which is now the latest whereby if one server is not responding the second one can be able to unscramble the channels and you have uninterrupted view even whereby there is an ip attack by your service provider by your internet service provider actually it can still be able to work uh, so let's just go back a little bit make sure we update the decoder so this is where you update it from uh, under ftp i think you can be able to look at uh, the latest which is the um 30th of april uh, as one to be able to uh, download so let me download this version which is the freedom no the mos menu the normal one um you give it some time it's eight mbs so as we wait for it to be able to complete its download we shall see its difference its differences come through and how best we can be able to uh, use this is something very easy to be able to do uh, i hope um, everyone out there can be able to update their decoder it's very much more important to update your decoder because if your decoder is updated remember you're having the latest uh, server to unlock the channels and also in case of any other applications that are not working uh, the updates um, can be able to clear such error codes or errors in the application so it's telling me do not switch off which i'm going to do as we wait for uh, the decoder to be able to complete its progress in updating then we can see if we have the latest server available everything is raw uncut i like to keep it that way because uh, many of you out there may say that this is a lie this is a hoax he's doing something uh, quite different um, he's trying to cut out the other parts uh, no that's not the way i do it uh, even if the video is five minutes uh, it's much more important so that you can be able to know why it's going five minutes not leaving out any single step so that's where we are let's wait for it a little bit to be able to complete it's very much more advisable like i said earlier on to be able to update your decoder and have the uninterrupted service especially when it comes to unscrambling of the channels and when this is done normally you have to rescan the channels but i'm just looking at um, an option whereby we just need to check if we have the latest um, server version here which is 147 which we want remember this is a 4k decoder and the forever pro uh, or i am forever pro is different from the forever server because this was designed for 4k decoders and if you have such a decoder you can have uh, access to sky italia uh, sky uk and um, you can be able to have lots of other channels uh, that are unscrambled yeah using the different um, uh, satellites 
Take an example, if you're in Africa, you'll be able to have a to sell at uh, 36B there. Then uh, you can also be able to access bad air that is uh, 26 East. So it's successful. Let's just see it will have to reboot. Okay, it's saying no signal at the moment uh, because the decoder is booting. Um, a little bit. Okay, it's coming on. Yeah. It has come on. Uh, I'm using a non 4K TV, so you can look at the 1080 pixels. Yeah, that's how that's how it starts. Media star very much more different uh, from the rest. So what I want us to go through, if I cancel that, is try to see if we are now into um, the latest server. So it's still unknown. I have to now connect to my. I have to connect to uh, my internet. Okay, so let's see if it can be able to connect just a little bit. Okay, right, it has been able to connect, so let's get back behind and see if we have the right full server. So it has not changed to 147, but at least this is the best we can be able to do. Let me just try to uh, bring it to the default server. I can press info on my remote, select C146. But um, okay, that's the way the update is done, but it will be able to change with time to 147, which is available at the moment. So uh, guys, in case you have any questions to be able to ask or in case you have any um, inquiries on how be able to operate an update or operate the decoders you can be able to drop the comments um, in the comment section below so don't forget to like subscribe and share with your friends